The Foreseen Arcade. Active. Family, romance, death. Visit Banzer. It's great good. So that's Banzer. Strange place, I know, but they need what we're selling, see? I've got you a meeting with the Lord Mayor today. So don't miss that bus. Are you listening? Get going! What are you still doing here, boy? Get out! Little fella. <laughs> nice to have you around. Thank goodness you're here. I spied a shiny tuppence down this hair runoff. But more fool me, my arm has become trapped. Perhaps you might see about sourcing some lubrication, and I might slip free. Hmm? I need something greasy to slip me out of here. Hey! Oof! Pasty, but Meg's in Torpen. Oh, I guess I'll starve. Oh no. Oof. I'm sorry, sir. We're closed this morning. Because this dolt has lost my keys. And now we've got to wait for that useless locksmith. Oh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Meg. What am I like? Colin, you are the most work shy fop I've ever had the misfortune to employ. The problem with chicken. Hey. 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 
bricks. Come get your bricks. Bricks by the brick, bricks by the bag. High quality bricks by Nick. That's me. Oh. Just the man I need. The mayor's asked me to clean up this little rose garden. You can start by getting on that mower. Somewhere. Don't be shy, lad. Give that lawn mower the old grab and squeeze. Just like in the day. Oh, silly me. How do you do, young man? Almost done, and then I can finally get home to my puzzles. I love puzzles. No chance of any of them round here, though. Oh. That is a fine stamen. My wife could live a thing or two. Nice firm grip on that mower, lad. I tell you, Reggie's oh, wife dear. could learn a thing or two. <laughs> Somewhere. Uh. Well, I guess no breakfast for me. Oh. Typical. I never get my way. Ah! Ah! Charlie, I hope he gets that tuppence.
morning. Council tax all paid. How about a cobbler's pint, eh? What's a cobbler's pint, then? It's like a normal pint. But I take both my shoes off. Ah, uh, I'd love to, Ronnie, but the beer's coming out all flat. Flat? Well, why don't you go down into the cellar and knock a few barrels about? Slim chance of that. I don't even know how to get downstairs. You can't get downstairs in your own place. Call you down there, lad. Give those bottles a shake up, won't ya? Hey, looking good up here! Nothing like a nice wet pint to start the day. Every morning I wake up, kind of lager, then I do a big wee, then I get out of bed and I go downstairs for my morning pint. You know, you need steady hands to be a locksmith. Ah, Larry, you were just talking about my morning pint. I think I'll take it now, please. Right you are, Ronnie. Another morning pint coming up. You working today then, fella? Yes. In fact, I'm supposed to be at Meg's already, I think. I'll be back in a moment for my morning pint. Oh, what's he like, eh? Come on then, let's pour you a pint and all. On the house. That Ronnie's a character. He'll be back later, I reckon. One small with vigor! <coughs> it's no use! Oh dear. Thanks for fetching that, Ronnie lad. I'd offer you a pasty, but we're not cooked yet. Help yourself to our front back, though. Darling! What on earth are you doing with that mop, boy? Oh, gosh. I'm sorry, Mrs. Meg. My mum's got me back on the mercury again. Give me strength. Oh, you found me. I'm the fridge stoat, and I'm awfully frigid. Ah, no, I just... I'm actually the town vole, if you catch my meaning. Tuppence! 
for the thruppence. Pray tell, young thruppence, where best to spend ye? Hmm? What ho, what luck? A wishing well. God speed, young thruppence. Oh, oh you blooming turnip. In for a penny. penny.